I'm originally from Mexico. I came here when I was four years old. Growing up, you know, I come from a big family. I'm the oldest child. Both of my parents worked as an oldest child, especially for my culture, you know, it's like, you're the mom. I'm new in high school, you know, first year freshman. I met this guy. He asked me to date him. I said yes. A couple of weeks went by and he was like, I'm planning to go to California. Do you want to come? When I started high school, that's around the time my parents, you know, they separated. I just wanted to have a family. Like, I just wanted to be with my mom and my dad. It was like I was on my own. I felt empty. I went to school one morning and took a couple clothes and didn't come back. Two weeks later, we were pulled over. The next morning, our parents came over and brought us home. I found out a couple months later I was pregnant. So I became a mom at 16. But after I had the baby, you know, he convinced me to move in with him. We got our own apartment. The loneliness about being a single parent, you know, you want someone there with you to support you. I didn't know what to expect. He started being physically abusive. I found out I was pregnant again, so I was like, wait, maybe, well, maybe that's gonna change him. It just got worse and worse. It was hell. He was trying to hurt me. And I was screaming. Nobody heard me, nobody came. Until the next day I was able to get out. Well, he was put in jail. You know, I had to go back to my parents. I was confused, I didn't know what to do, I was scared. I would question myself, what's wrong with me? What's going on, like, what did I do wrong? The first time I came to Hope back, was back in 2013. After Pastor Mark started talking and delivering the message, I was like, okay, well, the next week, I'm gonna give it another try. The more he continued, the more I felt like he was really talking to me. That's when I decided, okay, I wanna be a Christian. I decided to get baptized. I, I knew I was ready. I know that no matter what, even if it's the hardest time, I know God is always there. I hope by supporting my family. I really appreciate everything. I heard Pastor Mike encourage you to join a small group. I had no idea what it was like. Everything was so new. I joined the single moms group. It's amazing. The more I came, the more I loved it. I've been there for two years now. A whole lot of things changed in my life. I have a family and I can count on them. I know I'm not alone and I know I'm not the only one.